Okay, what I'm going to discuss tonight, um, I thought about after doing the last video I've done, uh, which was the Blogging 101 on WordPress themes. In that video, I was showing people uh, how to upload files to their website. So what I'm going to do is show you the software which I use. Uh, it's a Firefox plugin and it's free. So if you're not happy with your current um, uploader, or you've never used Uploader before, I would recommend this one highly. Uh, just for people to get back to the basics, what a uh, Uploader does is uploads files directly to your site without you having to log in manually and, and do it that way. So it's sort of, if you've got like 50 files to go to your site, uh, it's quite easy to do. Uh, you just basically put them there and and, and point the direction you want them and up that upload they do so anyway the first thing you need to do is go to tools okay now you can see I've got the um, fire FTP loader already installed uh, but what I'll do is we'll go to add-ons And probably the simplest way is just to browse all add-ons and get another window opening. And this is one of the reasons why I like using Firefox. Uh, there's so many different plugins. I've only covered a handful of them, but <laughs> yeah, everyone's saying to me, "Well, yeah, great type thing." Um, I don't know why the window hasn't popped up. Anyway, we'll put in FTP and see what happens. Ah, here it comes now. Well, just a bit slow, the computer tonight. I've got the other video uploading at the moment, so <laughs> it's sort of taking its toll on things. Uh, plus I've got a bit of rain in the background you may know so okay FTP uh, the process for doing this add-on is the same as all the other add-ons uh, which will run through once again for those people who haven't seen the other videos Okay, it's the first one which comes up. Now look, I'm not saying these other FTP loaders, uh, there's anything wrong with them. But I've used this on, uh, let me see, let's try and think, operating so XP and Windows 7 and it works well. Uh, you can have multiple sites as long as you've got your logins. Okay, so all you do is click Add to Firefox. Okay, and then you press install now. Alright, I've already got it, so I'm not going to do it. But it's the same as any other add on. And once you install it, shut down Firefox, reopen Firefox, and it should be right here. Now, the one reason I like this um, loader the most is because it's on my Firefox. It's just, if you like, man, you've got that much software on your computer for various things it takes up room and you gotta find it you know where this is just in Firefox okay now once you've got it all you need to do is create an account now these settings you'll need to get are from your host okay and you fill them in here Alright, this is to create our account to access, not to create our account for the uploader. Alright, so, as you can see here, here's mine. 
Alright, I haven't got my other sights in here. Okay, this is a good way to go by. It. My account name is my email address with Yahoo. Okay. And FTP address is dcompany.biz. Alright. And my login is dcompany at dcompany.biz. And I'm not telling you the password. <laughs> But that's pretty much the information you need to put in. So that if you go off the information you, you go on when you access your site via the web, uh, pretty much it should be you know you log in and your password for your domain. Okay, where it's hosted, and just put uh, FTP and your web web address. So if it's PeteSmith.com, just put FTP PeteSmith.com. Okay, so that's how you set up the um, uploader. Now, if I press connect, uh, it will bring up the details of my website and what's on it. Uh, these files over here, as you can see, it says C, that is my uh, computer's files. Okay, so if I go into instance we'll send an image or something <laughs> uh, let's go to Dave pictures okay see how it brings up all my images all right so if I want to send one of these okay what I do is I connect Now what's this is doing once you set up um, your existing web hosting to the program is it's connecting with the site. At the moment it's connecting with Yahoo for me. <coughs> so you can see down the bottom of the screen it's it's doing its business. We haven't had any red come up yet. It's a little bit slow tonight. That's probably because I've got a bit of bad weather here and I'm using uh, satellite. Okay, now we've got the files open. What you want to do is pick where you want to put uh, the file. So, for instance, my website has quite a few um, files in various areas. Um, for demo purposes, I'm going to open Dave's Picks. Your website probably won't have as many files and various areas. Alright, so as you can see, there's one picture in here. So all you need to do is to take it from your computer. Instance, I'll put this one in there. Now all you do is press set. Okay, if you look down the bottom of the screen, you'll see the um, it's doing its thing. Now, yes, you could do this through your your website back office, uh, but when you want to start sending a whole folder with, let's say, a hundred pictures to send to it. Um, or there's a program I'm going to run on my website, uh, for instance, like last night's demo, we were doing uh, the WordPress themes and we were sending a whole file across. So, yeah, it, it varies, but you can see how quickly it went up. And like I say, tonight I've had a few issues uh, with my internet due to the fact of the weather. So, now you can see which David Detman ping is now in that file. And that is simply how you do it. It's very easy. Um, just to recap, all you do is download the uh, plugin. Once you've got the plugin, you go to Tools, and it's there, uh, Fire FTP. So if you have any questions, ask me in the Skype room, 
or if you'd like to leave your feedback on this video please do it on the bonus tips blog I'd really appreciate that thanks again this is Dave for bonus tips